What's going on guys? I am Darren the Bowtie Fragrance Guy. We talk about fragrances on this channel, but I also like to give you guys some tips on how you can look your best as well. So, you know, from the standpoint of what you wear every day to your grooming. So if you're into that kind of content, make sure you hit subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell icon as well. So that way, anytime I upload a new video, you guys will get notified. So on today, guys, it is Valentine's Day, right? The day of or for lovers. And uh, if you did miss the video that I did with the missus on last week, I'll make sure that I tag that or actually include that video here. Uh, so that way you can check that video out. But in that video, I gave five fragrances from my collection. Well, we did five from my collection that she liked that thought she would be good for a guy for Valentine's Day. And I chose five from her collection that I thought would be good for a lady on Valentine's Day. So I wanted to kind of continue on that theme and give you guys 10 more great recommendations for valentine's day so this is going to be good man so if you want to see what i have on the list you know the routine keep it locked right here let's get it The Bowtie Fragrance Guy. All right, guys, we're back. Thank you so much for keeping it locked in. We're going to jump into this list of amazing fragrances that are great for Valentine's Day. Now, when I think about Valentine's Day fragrances, I immediately think about, you guys have heard me say this before, roses and chocolate. That's what, you know, typically uh, men buy for women as gifts on Valentine's Day, especially when we were in, like, grade school, high school. You went to school, you had your teddy bear for your lady. You had a box of chocolates and you had some roses. That's how we did it. So those things automatically come to my mind when I think about Valentine's Day. They often, those notes, make for a great, sexy, date night kind of scent profile. But all the fragrances you're going to see today are going to have either roses and chocolate, one or, one or both, or the combination of the two, or thought about other notes like honey, cherry. Use your imagination. So let's get right into it. The first fragrance that we're going to talk about is from the brand of Tom Ford. This is for uh, you guys out there that want a fresher option uh, for Valentine's Day. If it's a little warmer outside where you live, this will be a great choice from Tom Ford. This is Rose D'Amalfi. All right, Rose D'Amalfi. Don't be fooled, guys. This is not just for women, but this is Mandarin, Rose, Heliotrope, and Almond. So that Heliotrope Almond combination is almost like a double dose of almond uh, in this fragrance, but it gives this uh, really nice sensuality to the scent profile along with the rose. So again, this is a really fresher uh, fragrance right here. So like I said, if you're in a, a city or a state where it's going to be hot on Valentine's Day, this is a great option because, you know, some of the other fragrances are a lot more dense than this one. So I wanted to give a fresh option here from the brand of Tom Ford. This is a fresh rose fragrance. This is Rose D. Amalfi. The next fragrance I would say is also a little bit more on the fresher side, honestly. This one comes from the brand of By Killing. This is called Can't Stop Loving You. Yep, I know the song is going through your head right now. Orange Blossom, Jasmine, Honey, and Vanilla are some of the main notes. This is really, really nice, guys. I really like, there's the honey note. Like the sweetness of Orange Blossom here works really well with that sweet honey uh, in this fragrance. I think there's oak moss here too. So really, uh, if you think about that, uh, a lot of the notes that I talked about, this has jasmine as well, you would think feminine, but that oak moss really makes this a, a really nice unisex scent. But I think it will work great for Valentine's Day, especially because it contains that note of honey. So go ahead. Now that song's gonna be stuck in your head for the rest of the day. Those of you that are old school are gonna give yourself away because you know what song I'm talking about. All right, this fragrance is from the brand of By Killing. This is called Can't Stop Loving You. And that was by Michael Jackson, just in case you didn't know. All right, guys, this next fragrance up, if sensuality were a fragrance, it would probably be this one. From the brand of Fragrance Dubois, created exactly for a day like Valentine's Day, this is called Lovers. Lovers. And this fragrance is gonna feature note, uh, notes of passion fruit, plum, rose, 
and saffron. So again, right out of the gates, double dose of sensuality. I think those two notes that are considered fruit notes of passion fruit and plum are the most sensual that you can find in perfumery. And you have both of them here in this fragrance with that saffron in there because there's leathery feel to it um, along with the rose. Super sensual fragrance from the brand of fragrance we bought. This is created exactly as the name said for lovers. So it's made to be shared and worn by both men and women alike. Um, I know fragrances from Fragrance Dubois, as well as some of these other niche brands can, keep, can be kind of expensive. So, with that being said, Fragrance Dubois, the company actually sent me a travel set. This is called their Lover's Collection, guys, and all three of the fragrances in here were created to be shared for men and women. Cavort, Lovers, and also Secret Triest. Now, I think, if I'm not mistaken, I only have four Lovers, from this uh, lovers collection, but they all are really, really good from what I've heard about the other two. So it comes in a box like this. It's a nice travel set. There are uh, three 7.5 ml um, itemizers in here. So I'm gonna get this out of the box and just show you guys really quick what it looks like. So here's the box. Right there's a tab underneath here. You open the tab like this. Well, this is really nice. Wow. Okay. And you have all, a sample of all three of the fragrances here, 7.5 ml in each. And then this is, looks like a really nice, wow, this is really nice, guys. This looks like a nice um, case for your uh, fragrance. It's gold in color and it, a magnetic cap on here. And then you just take the fragrance and slide it in here. All right, and this is really, really nice, man. Really heavy. So it's really, really high, uh, nice quality here on this. So whichever fragrance that you want to take with you for the day, uh, you just slide it into this case and uh, enjoy the fragrance. Okay, so this is Cavort. Let me show you this. This is Cavort. So again, you just open this, slide it in here. Boom, really simple. There you go. And put the cap on it. That is dope, man. So you would be able to travel with this in style, I might add, with this nice case for the fragrance. That is dope, man. Let me get a spray of this because I've never smelled, smelled Cavort before. So this would be a good time to go ahead and get my nose on it. Put the cap off. Nice sprayer. There's another little cap there. Ooh, I like this one. Ooh, I like this one even better than Lovers. Gee whiz. Ooh, I like this one, Cavort. I haven't smelled the other one yet, but I will get around to smelling Secret Treats as well. But if you don't want to have a full bottle, invest into a full bottle, all three of those fragrances, again, were made for the Lovers collection to be shared between you and the missus. So it might be a great gift for both of you for Valentine's Day. All right, guys, the next fragrance on the list, this is all in the name of the fragrance. It's from the brand of Mancera. This is Roses and Chocolate. And what's in here? Yep, you guessed it, Roses and Chocolate. <laughs> uh, but in addition to the Roses and Chocolate, there's also some vanilla in here, a little bit of a musk on the dry down. Uh, this is the only time I really pull this fragrance out is like a date night or Valentine's Day. This has been my scent of the day before for Valentine's Day. Maybe again, I don't know, we'll see. But I really like it. Um, it's really heavy on the chocolate in the opening, almost like a Tootsie Roll. There's another fragrance on this list that kind of smells like that in the opening as well. But anyway, if you like roses and chocolate, you'll love this. From the brand of Mancera, roses and chocolate. All right, we're going to go on a little run here of fragrances that really highlight the note of chocolate, which again is another note that I think is great for date nights, especially Valentine's Day. This one is called Noir Aphrodisiac from by Killian. All right, and this is chocolate, cinnamon, and iris. But... Primarily, you're going to get a lot of chocolate, but I love the way the cinnamon blends so perfectly with the chocolate here. Uh, a little bit powdery, of course, there's iris, but if you like chocolate, great option for Valentine's Day, Noir Aphrodisiac. And next up is my favorite fragrance that features a note of chocolate in my collection. This is called Sorizo from the brand of Profumum Roma. Uh, this is chocolate, vanilla, and bitter orange. I've said it before and I will say it again. This smells like a chocolate cake. That's what it smells like, but it smells really good on skin and it lasts a long time, just like 
a lot of the other fragrances from this collection, from this brand. So check it out from the brand of Perfumum Roma. This is called Sorizo. All right, guys, now we're going to switch it up. All right, we're going to switch it up and throw some cherry into the fray here. All right, so we're going to get away from the other fruit notes. Uh, we're going to get away from the passion fruit and stuff like that. We're going to go with cherry. And uh, this is great from the brand of Mind Game. This is called French Defense. Cherry, rose, and amber are the main notes. And that's exactly what you're really going to get here. Big dose of cherry in the opening. Uh, with the rose and then of course the amber dry down. That's really what this fragrance is at its core And as you guys know how I feel about this one, it smells phenomenal. So check this one out This would be a great date night Valentine's Day fragrance from the brand of mind games. This is French defense All right, this next fragrance comes from the brand of Bodicea the Victorious and this one is called Ardent This is Ardent. This is rose, beeswax, amber, musk, and saffron oh this is so good man i had honey bee beeswax in here uh with the rose um it's just really really to die for man this is a more honeyed beeswaxed version of tom Ford's noir de noir which is a rose fragrance that i love talk about dark and sensual rose that's exactly what this is and that beeswax really takes that that idea that scent profile to the next level when you talk about sex appeal so check it out from the brand of Bodo City Victorious. This is called Ardent. Another amazing rose fragrance from the brand of Initial Parfums. This is Atomic Rose. Really love this one, guys. This is uh, Bulgarian and Turkish rose, jasmine and amber. The jasmine uh, provides a little bit of a fresh floral nuance to this fragrance, but it's all about that amber dry down with the two variety of roses here. Amazing fragrance from the brand of Initio Parfums. If you like rose, this is the one from the collection for you to really check out and put your nose on. This is Atomic Rose. And last but not least, this fragrance comes from the Armani Privé collection. This one is called Rose D. Atterby. Rose D. Atterby from the brand of Armani, the Privé collection. And this is Rose, Oud, Patchouli, and Vanilla. So this is a really dark and sexy rose fragrance probably the darkest fragrance on the collection because of course i'm in on this list because you have that oud in there but nonetheless high quality rose fragrance really really sexy if you're going somewhere on a day on valentine's day and you're going to be wearing all black wear this from the brand of armani the pre collection this is rose d atterby but that is it guys that is my time i hope you enjoyed this video today as always i sincerely appreciate you guys' time and attention to these videos. I know you don't have to watch, but you do, and I sincerely appreciate that. Now, don't forget to take a few moments to like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you're sharing these videos out to some other folks out there that you think could use the information or find it entertaining. Because I'm your guy, Darian. I'm the Voltaire Fragrance Guy. I love to look good, and of course, I love to smell amazing. So until next time, keep looking good, keep smelling even better. I'll catch you on the flip side. Peace.